One of the smelliest flowers, yeah, smelly flower you may ever come across is living on UT's campus. And to explain why, I have with me Caitlin Paula, the UT Assistant Greenhouse Manager. Caitlin, the corpse flower is behind us. Why is it called that? So it's called the corpse flower. It actually comes from an Indonesian word which literally translates to corpse flower, and that's because of the scent that it emits. Um, it's mainly uh, smelling like a very rotten individual that um, will attract its pollinators. Um, so they will be attracted to that scent, want to come, lay their eggs in it, and that's how they actually disperse pollen between individuals. Oh, and then we have to wait several more years for that pollen to activate, is that correct? <laughs> so actually, um, if the pollen does get transferred between the male and the female flowers, um, those female flowers will probably take around nine months to produce a fruit that has a seed within it. And, you know, you know, hopefully that is a viable seed that can drop off, be eaten by a hornbill, which, you know, eats those red fleshy fruit and yeah. will be dispersed throughout the wild. Cool. And, and that's important because this is an endangered plant. Yes. It's estimated that there are fewer than a thousand left in the wild. So very, very rare. Um, you know, there's almost that much in um, private collections and uh, botanic gardens like ours. Um, uh, there's estimated to be around 500, um, but potentially more. And if people want to come see Roddy Top, as y'all have named it, you will have hours here at the Hessler Biology Building, correct? Yes, we'll make sure that we have some extended building hours so people can come see it, smell it, and take a picture. <laughs> well, if you want to come see it, smell it, take a picture, they will keep you posted online when Roddy Top is going to bloom. I will send it back to y'all. No desire here to smell it. <laughs> Just going to be real honest. Meanwhile, we are looking live at Roddy Top. It still hasn't bloomed, but we are certainly keeping an eye out on the corpse flower. Mm. Still ahead, people from.